Hello friends and fellow flute enthusiasts and welcome back. Today's an exciting day. I wanted to take you on a behind the scenes look at the new membership for Horizons, known as Horizons Plus. Um, there have been some questions that have come up and I wanted to answer some of those um, top questions uh, today um, that you may have. Um, and also know that there's an extensive um, questions and support uh, feature here on our website. Uh, love this little owl. <laughs> He's so cute. Uh, but we have things broken down by categories. So you'll see content questions, you'll see courses versus membership, uh, billing questions, um, and also um, you'll see some questions around access and login. How do I get to my account? Where do I log in? How do I navigate this thing? Um, and then at the bottom here, this is important. I want to show you this too because as you go through these questions, if you have a question about something, and you can't find the right answer, um, please reach out to us. You can do that right here at this email support that comes over to us and we'll take a look at that. We may add that question to this page. We want this to be a really good resource for you um, so you can navigate and find the answer that you need uh, to make the best decision possible. So today I'm gonna take you inside the membership so you can get a look at it. Those of you that, um, um, those of you that have been members um, or a student in the Native Flute Academy, we changed the name from Native Flute Academy to Horizons. And one of the biggest questions that I've gotten is, does anything change for me? Um, where I log in, how I log in, my login credentials. Nothing for you changes. Um, you still log in. Uh, we changed the name of the platform um, and everything it should be redirecting. Um, so there's a couple of new URLs that we have and any old URL that you have bookmarked should work too. It should just point to the new one and you should log in with the same email address that you have and the same password. If you get stuck, there's some stuff on that FAQ page um, that, that will help you get access to your new course or um, access to um, the old platform, which is actually the new one too. Um, but that should help you. If you get stuck, please reach out and email support. Today, let's go through here. So you've probably seen the new website. This is, um, this is not my website. This is the website for Horizons. There's still johnnyliffordmusic.com, which is where you'll find flutes, backing tracks, sheet music, um, all sorts of stuff. Right now we have a, um, a countdown timer. We have a countdown timer to the big reveal. And we're gonna be offering membership in both um, monthly and yearly. And those that commit to a year subscription of this new membership, will get a private party with me. Uh, it's called a fireside event. Uh, I'll share some new music. I'll show you what I'm working on, new announcements, um, Q and A. Um, we'll just like, as if we were to hang out around a campfire, that's kind of what I envision this event to be. So you'll get to hang out with me for a little while and I may have some extra perks for you too. Um, so anyway, let's get into the membership itself. You can look at this website and see all the different perks that are involved, but I wanna show you, and as we go through this, I'll explain what these things mean, uh, cause there's some questions coming up too. Let's go to the student dashboard. So after you become a member, this is what the membership will look like. This is behind the scenes. Um, and so we have a navigation here at the top to help you navigate certain things and this stays throughout the website. Then there's the side navigation here and that's what we're gonna be working through today. There's a banner here that shows kind of important pertinent information. So um, the new lesson modules, I wanna talk about that next. Um, and it also has in here the live Q&A sessions. Uh, that went kind of fast live Q&A sessions, as well as a community. So we're gonna be going through this list of things here. This video can be kind of lengthy, so um, please be patient with me here. So courses, you already know what those are. Um, one of the questions that I've gotten is, how is membership different than the courses that I've already purchased? If you've already purchased a course through my website, which you know, connected to the Native Flute Academy. Um, if you have purchased a course, you still have access to that. It's not a membership or nothing kind of platform. 
we're still going to support those who only want to purchase a course and not do a membership monthly or yearly thing. If you just need a certain course, you want to take a certain course, you can still buy that even after membership launches. The difference between the membership and then purchasing a course um, individually, if you purchase a course individually, you have access to that for lifetime, right? For as long as we have Horizons platform, you have access to that course. You can log in, log out, take it again, however many times you want. If you get access to a course, say you bought Achieving Embellishments, but none of the other courses, and you sign up for the membership, you'll keep access to Achieving Embellishments if you come into membership and go out of membership. You still have that course. You bought that, it's yours, okay? But when you're a member, you get access to all these other courses. And when you're a member, for as long as you're a member, you have access to those courses and a bunch of other cool stuff. But if you cancel your membership, you no longer have access to those things. So that's the difference between the membership and purchasing a course individually. If you're in the membership and you want to buy a course, so you have it, say you're getting ready to leave membership, but you want to have access to that course, you can purchase it. And after you leave membership, you'll still have access to that course. We didn't want this to be a kind of an all or nothing situation. So we wanted you to have options and I want to inform you of those. So let's keep moving. Lesson modules. This is one of the more exciting things about this. In addition to the courses right now, there's nothing there. Um, and that's because we're going to, well, minus that, I'll talk about that in a second, but lesson modules. What are lesson modules? Lesson modules are like this. If you and I were to sit down and have a lesson, um, every couple of weeks, what would I teach you? Well, I, the lesson modules will come out on the 1st and the 15th of every month. And the, the lessons will change and I'll be building out certain things with lessons. So um, we'll have our first lesson module come on April 1st and then another lesson module will come on April 15th. Another lesson on May 1st, May 15th, June 1st, June 15th, so forth and so on. So this is our plan of moving forward with lessons. It gives you time to um, time to work on that assignment, time to work on that task and any resources that you need. Um, some lessons you'll need an MP3 or a PDF or some sort of chart or whatever. Whatever I give to you, um, it will include those resources if it's pertinent to the thing that you're gonna work on. Now these are not live sessions, so you don't have to show up for anything. You can do them on, on your own time. It'll be a lot, it'll feel a lot like coursework, right? You'll have a main video, you'll have some description, some help, um, and you'll have whatever resources that you need for that specific thing. And these are gonna range. Um, it's gonna range not only in topic, but also in skill level because we don't want to gear everything towards a beginner and we don't want to gear everything towards a really advanced player. We know, even when I give workshops and things like that, that you're at different levels. Um, you may not be as advanced in something, but this is where the growth mentality really starts to sink in. So that's what lesson modules are. And we'll be communicating a lot of this through the community and also through um, email. So we'll talk about those two things in a second. Workshop playbacks. Right now we have a couple of workshops in here that I did with a few of my colleagues um, last year. And so you'll get access to workshop playbacks as a part of your membership as well. So another opportunity to learn um, and learn from some other instructors as well. If I give a workshop in the future and I decide to put that into this workshop playbacks, you'll have access to that too. Um, some workshops that I give, I really want uh, to share. Um, if it's really important, I want you to really learn it and I want to put it in the membership, then you'll get access to that. So let's move on to upcoming Q&A sessions because this is where the support really comes together, right? You can get email support, that's okay. Um, but the live Q&A sessions are a place where um, I've experienced a lot of flute players who just have that burning question, that thing that they just can't get through and they just have a very specific, specialized question um, and an issue. 
and this is a time to bring those to the table. Um, we'll do this in a group setting, um, and we offer these twice a month, but they're not set in stone like every other Tuesday at six. Um, they, they vary because we're, we're working with people with different schedules, we're working with different time zones, we're working internationally as well. So I'm going to do my best to make sure that um, in the month that this works for international students, as well as people who maybe work a nine to five here in the United States or Canada. Um, so our first one, Saturday, April 9th at 10 a.m. Our second one for April is April 29th at 6 p.m. These are in central time. Um, we're gonna go through a time change, all that kind of stuff. Um, just mark your calendar. You do need to register. This will pull up a different registration page. Um, they're free for members to register. There's no cost. This is involved. This is included in your membership price. But I want you to register and there's a place that you can ask your question, put your question in the registration form itself. Uh, and you'll get updates on that. Add it to your calendar, especially if you um, put a question in there. This is a time where I'll take up to 10 questions. We do want to keep these short because we can go through a ton of questions and we could be here all day answering questions. So I cap it at 10 questions. We have roughly an hour to uh, 75 minutes that we're going to be together. We may run long, it depends, um, but I want to be mindful of your time during these. So we'll start, we'll jump right in, uh, make sure you're in the audience. These are the live Q&A sessions. You get two of these a month, two lesson modules. So now I'm going to hop back over here and we're going to take a look at recorded Q&A sessions. Again, right now there's nothing in here, um, but there will be. Um, as we go through these, um, I'll be uploading these for you to catch on replay. So we'll be recording the Zoom sessions and I'll come back and I'll upload them here. So if you can't catch it, you won't miss it. Um, the community, Horizons Plus community. This is a platform that's a lot like a Facebook group. I've heard from a lot of students of mine, a lot of people on YouTube, um, a lot of flute players who love the idea of being in a group, a uh, supportive group, but don't like Facebook policies or don't want to be a part of social media. While this looks like that, and it kind of acts like that, it's not that. It's not, it doesn't have anything to do with Facebook, it doesn't have anything to do with any of those other social media platforms. This is cooked directly into the um, Horizons platform. And this is a members only, so you have to be a member of the subscription, not just um, you ha you've purchased a course, but you have to be an active member in Horizons Plus. And we'll expand right now. There's not a lot of content in this community. We're just starting. But as we grow and you have questions, this is a great place to get um, peer feedback as well. You can do a lot of things in here like adding pictures. Um, so I was just kind of testing some things in here. And we'll break things down into categories like a forum would be. So it'll help you find certain things better and as admins we'll go in and we'll try to move things where they need to go as they come in so you can get technical help student introductions just general stuff and, and we may break out into different categories as well so that's the community aspect now there's one other thing that i want to cover here and that is monthly credits what is a monthly credit think of a monthly credit as um sort of like audible right each month you get a credit towards downloading an, um, an audiobook. Well, Horizons credits act kind of like that too. Each month will give you a special code that you can go over to my website and you can get a backing track or piece of sheet music of your choice for free. It's included in your monthly membership. Again, that's a members only perk. Um, check back on April 5th. Um, we're gonna be doing these on the 5th of every month. Um, where we'll be giving you that code. You can go over to my website, pick out a piece of sheet music, a song that you want to learn, or a backing track that you want to play along with, and you can start building your own library. Originally, we had planned on just providing a piece of sheet music or a backing track, and then it's it just kind of got boxed in. It's like, you go pick your own. What inspires you to play? So I uh, wanted to offer that to you as well. So these are the perks. The other perk that you get too is 
first dibs. First dibs is a big thing, especially as we launch new flutes, new programs, uh, SGLs, small group lessons. Um, these things fill up and sell out fast. And I've heard from many of you, uh, we launch a new flute, it's sold out really quick. Um, members, right? If you're on a monthly or yearly um, subscription to Horizons Plus, you get access to these things first. If I launch a new workshop, you get to buy tickets first. If I launch a new flute, you get to buy the flute first. So that's another perk that we really wanted to um, extend to you because um, because we can. Uh, we know that you're investing in in me and my teaching and all of us here, and we wanted to offer uh, an extra little perk back to you. The other thing that you'll find, so this goes over to my website where you can look for new flutes, right? Just one more. <laughs> um, but then you can also book a one-on-one -on -one session. Now this is not included in your membership. Um, there's additional cost for that because it's one-on-one -on -one time with me. Um, so you can do that here. And then this goes over to the support page. So. There's an extensive, um, I think I showed you this earlier, there's an extensive um, page here of questions and answers. I want to show you something very important and that's this thing right down here. If you have a question that you can't get answered on this page, please email us. Um, let us know uh, what your question is and we'll get back to you. It's really important that uh, we may add your question to this page um, if we, if we deem that it's appropriate for the page. But it's really important that we support you. We want you to grow. We want this membership to be something really special for you. Um, we've put a lot of work, um, time, energy into this. Uh, my brain spins sometimes with all the tech on the back end, but, um, but we want this to be a really unique and powerful experience for you. So if you have a question about anything, or as you go through this, we also ask that you be patient with us because while I've done a lot of teaching and I've had online courses online for a while, um, this is new and this is relatively big and we're in a lot of ways still trying to figure some of this stuff out. So be patient with us, but if you see something that just doesn't quite look right, uh, not navigating right, if you have feedback on something, use this thing right here under the FAQs and support page and email us. Please let us know what your experience is, is feeling like, what's going on. Because like I said, we really care about your growth as a flute player and the things that you're navigating through. So this is what the membership looks like. And I'm really pumped. I'm really pumped and I'm really thankful that you've supported us this far in um, in our journey, in my journey as a teacher. Um, I know that there's, there's a lot of options today online and in our world and our community um, for flute teachers. Um, and I've collaborated with many of these uh, folks. And I just wanted to say thanks. Thanks for, uh, thanks for working with me. Thanks for choosing uh, to work with me. Thanks for listening. Thanks for supporting. Thanks for uh, being a part of our really awesome community. So this is what I wanted to share with you today. Um, again, reach out if you have questions and I'm excited. We open membership March 13th. That's Sunday, March 13th. Uh, if you're watching this before um, or if you're watching it after, if you're watching it after, it's open. Let's go. Friends, thanks so much for watching. I hope to catch you in another video and I hope to see you on Horizons and in Horizons Plus. So take care and we'll see you soon.